High school football players across the nation dream to perform in front of the biggest crowds and in the largest venues in the world. That is exactly the road that Nick Covey has driven. Kinda. The 2005 Mountain Ridge graduate serves as the Jackman on the legendary Richard Childress Racing Number no. 3, lifting a 3,400-pound race car, living a life similar to what he knew growing up on the football field. I mean, it's just the same, right? We train, we go out, uh, we train three to five days a week, practice. Uh, we go in the weight room, work out, and then as far as Jackman, I mean, I'm jumping out in front of cars that are going 50, 60 miles an hour. Uh, one pit stall away, which is about, I don't know, 30 feet away, and you jump out in front of them, jack up the right side, run around, jack up the left side, put tires on, and still stay competitive, and that's about it. For more than a decade, Glendale, Arizona native Nick Covey has performed in front of over 100,000 fans at one of the biggest sporting events in the world, the legendary Daytona 500, an event that he won with Dale Earnhardt Jr. in 2014. And it all started on the gridiron after nearly starting his own racing career. At a very young age, we started uh, doing some uh, quarter midget stuff. We said, you're going to choose football or you're going to choose racing. And I chose football. But I'm back in racing, so just not driving the cars. Covey was part of the Mountain Ridge football team in 2004 that made the 5A state championship game as the 16 seed. Mark steps up into the pocket, finds Covey. The tight end linebacker hybrid earned a scholarship to the University of Nebraska, but an injury riddled college career spelled the end of his athletic career until an unlikely door opened, bringing him back full circle the beginning of his sports tour. There was a guy that worked at Nebraska that had a tie-in through one of the guys at Hendrick, and they started to run these uh, pit crew combines with ex-athletes that maybe didn't have an NFL future to go on. And there was a trial in Omaha, Nebraska, and I said, heck with it, and went and tried out. And they called me two months later and said, can you move to Charlotte? And that was it. Since joining the sport in 2009 and winning the Daytona 500 championship, Covey has become a staple in the NASCAR garage. And he still sees a handful of similarities that ignite his passion for sports today, just like he did 20 years ago. Just being staying competitive, uh, having a camaraderie with your guys and your teammates and still being able to, you know, not really have a real job. 